Hello, my name is Matthew Jemiasen. I am the Operations Coordinator at Redeemer Lincoln Square. I've been serving LSQ as an operational staff member as well as a musician for about two years. You can find me every Sunday morning making sure that the Sunday services are going smoothly and that your worship experience is safe and fruitful. If we've never met before, feel free to stop me sometime on Sunday morning and uh, I'd love to get a chance to meet you. Today is Monday, March 29th, and the theme for today is Jesus cleansing the temple. We begin with Jesus and his, and his disciples traveling to Jerusalem, uh, where Jesus is, go is wanting to preach. On their way, uh, they encounter a fig tree that is not bearing any fruit. Jesus then curses that tree and so that it will never bear fruit again. This was a, a great sign to the disciples of the authority that Jesus had on the earth. As they enter into Jerusalem, Jesus uh, then begins to see that there are uh, money changers and people selling pigeons, livestock, and other goods in the temple. Jesus becomes really angry with this and starts overthrowing the tables and scattering the coins and driving them out of the temple, uh, stating that uh, that this is a house of prayer and they have made it, made it a den of robbers. After this event, the blind and the lame come approaching Jesus and he begins to heal them. This is such a, a significant and really uh, amazing, amazing story to read uh, from my perspective because it shows that um, uh, he was not worried about the human consequences of these, these actions. I mean, so many people were angry with, with this event uh, and maybe was even a part of the catalyst to, that led him to the, the, the cross of, of the end, you know, his death. And, um, but he was not concerned with that. Uh, he, he was just filled with the authority that he had and he wanted to share, show that. He didn't want to profit from sin. He wanted to save people like me, like you. So I'd encourage you to read the full account of this event, and you can read that at Matthew 21, chapter, or Matthew chapter 21, verses 12 through 22, Mark chapter 11, verses 12 through 19, and Luke chapter 19, verses 45 through 48.